Hey, what's up, everyone? Uh, this video is mainly a request. Uh, it's not something I wanted to do. It's not something I wanted to make. It was just a request. I do go to my Discord. I do check my forums uh, and my PlayStation and my Xbox to see what people want, to see the requests. Uh, and the one question's been asked, uh, what about a game mode motion flow customization like what do I recommend in terms of uh, judder reduction and blur reduction here we are on the uh, God of War PlayStation 4 Pro version how much of blur reduction and judder reduction would you recommend uh, adjusting here on this game well the best thing to do in my opinion I always tell people too high it's not good too low it's not good because then you are you know defeating the purpose of the motion flow I always tell people try to balance it everything you do should be a balance how much of coffee do you drink should be balanced how much of uh, exercise do you do in the gym should be balanced everything should be a balance you know life it's about balance everything's a balance the key word if you want to enjoy your life you know what the key word is balance Balance means discipline, uh, doing things on time, uh, being responsible. Balance. The word, the key word is balance. So this key word balance, something that I use to imply onto a uh, technical aspect of the televisions. So, all right. For those of you who are new to this television, Q8FN or Q9FN. Uh, Q8FN, Q9FN pretty much have the similar features. They're exactly the same features, same user interface. All right, the first thing first, if you want to get to the game mode motion flow, motion flow features, number one, you have to be on the game mode. Okay, as you can see right here, I am on the game mode. It's highlighted right there. It says game mode. So the, what you want to do is you want to go to the settings, don't go to the picture settings. You cannot adjust game mode through picture settings. You have to scroll down to a general settings. And then on the general settings, you go back over here and click on the external device manager. When you click to external device manager, then you come down here to the game mode settings. And this is where you can adjust your free sync, your game mode automatic or on or off and then game motion plus now here I turn off the free sync because uh, PlayStation 4 Pro doesn't support free sync so what's the point of me using the free sync if it doesn't support it uh, game motion plus settings there you go right here you click on them and here is where you can adjust it I would stay away from the LED clear motion if you turn this on all you're gonna do it's gonna dim down that backlit it's going to look fast, but it's going to be very dimmed. So you don't, you don't want to use this. So what I have here, it's blur reduction to 5 and judder reduction to 5. And I honestly believe this is the best. This is what I talk about when I say balanced. When I say keep something balanced, this is what I mean. Leave the blur at 5 and judder reduction at 5. Now, this is not some kind of a law like some kind of biblical law, law, you have to go by this. I want to clarify something. Whatever I say, guys, it's my preference. But you come to my channel to hear what I have to say. I'm not saying you have to follow these exact same rules, all right? Like I would have some idiots come to my channel trying to tell me, oh, your settings are all wrong. No, you idiot, you are wrong. To coming to my channel trying to tell me my settings are wrong, this and that. Those are my preferences. Take it or leave it, man. Okay, it's not a Bible, it's not a law. And when someone comes to me like that, they get blocked. I have zero tolerance for that kind of nonsense, dude. When you open your mouth, when you start typing on your keyboard telling me my custom preference is wrong, I don't waste time with that. I just block you and remove you, man. You're wasting my time. Especially when there's some guy with some pimped picture with him and his girlfriend there trying to tell me and he only has like one subscriber he's trying to freaking tell me my settings are wrong that's your opinion they're not wrong they're my preference okay there's a difference
All right, so keep the uh, jutter reduction at five and uh, blur at five. Jutter and blur should be all balanced, should be all at five. I recommend that you do that, and it really looks good, man. It's really fluid. It's really smooth. Uh, you don't see any kind of uh, interpolation. You don't see not, no artifacts, nothing. Everything is smooth. Uh, there's no ghosting. You know, uh, some people say that there's ghosting. There's really no ghosting here. Uh, the Samsung really has one of the best motion flows and the game modes that I have seen, honestly. Uh, even better than Sony. Look how smooth this is. Uh, they have one of the best motion flows for the game and for the movies that I have seen. And I've seen them all, guys. You know I have tons of TVs, man. Okay? You guys know how many TVs I have. This is not coming. I want to clarify something, really. Guys, I don't care if you get jealous. I don't care if you get butthurt. I have over 3,260 videos to back up every and each claim. This is not me bragging. This is the fact. Okay? And deal with that. Or don't unsubscribe. I give less than a shit. Alright? But don't type me on the comment section why you unsubscribing. Because if you do that, you're confusing me with someone who gives a shit. Ask my loyal subscribers. They will tell you, Mr. 4K, he doesn't give a shit what you think. And if that's not clear to you, well, you will be blocked immediately, and it will be clear to you immediately. Okay, guys? I'm not a dick, but don't waste my time. Don't think you know me and you figured me out. You haven't figured shit, nothing. Figure yourself out. Leave me alone. Either you like the video or you don't. You don't, don't watch me, block me, never come to my channel. You can filter me out. Okay? If you don't make videos about me, go ahead and make videos about me. But don't come to my channel telling me about it. Yeah, okay. Is that clear? That should be clear. And I'm sorry if this butt hurts some of you guys, but I have to mention this. I had to address this, so that way I give you a warning. So when you decide to type something on this video, you think real hard about what you're typing. Think about it. Use your head when you're typing on a comment section. Think about... Uh, What's going to happen? What are the consequences if I write this or if I write that? Think about that. Just like you should think about the consequences in real life when you approach someone and you say something wrong. Think about the consequences. All right? This is my channel, my rules. You don't like it, don't watch it. Okay? I think Expert Joey said it the best, my friend Expert Joey. You don't like it, don't watch it. Unfilter me. I mean, filter me out and you're never going to see my channel. It's really that simple. Guys, I'm not forcing anybody to watch my videos, okay? Yes, I do show up on the 4K. When you Google me in 4K, I show up there. That's because I have over 3,260 videos. I've been doing this for four years now. Uh, Algorithm is going to show up my name, but you don't have to watch me. You can bypass me and watch someone else, okay? I'm not going to mention anybody's names out there, but you know who they are. And you can watch them, all right? But don't waste my time trying to tell me. I'm wrong this, I'm wrong that. Guys, stop with that. I mean, haven't you learned your lesson that this guy in four years doesn't give a shit? Okay? Haven't you guys learned that? And if you haven't, well, then you need to do a little bit better research about me and how long I've been doing this channel before you start farting on your comments. Okay? I'm my own boss. I run this channel. I'm not sponsored. I have a... First Amendment, I have a freedom of speech, I can use it, okay? You guys don't have to agree with it, but that's the way it is. Really simple, I run this channel, I self-sponsor myself, therefore I make the rules. So make sure you use the judder to uh, five and blur reduction to five. I mean, it's really smooth, uh, I would say that Samsung has the best motion flow that I have seen. I mean, and I do really mean that, guys. I mean, this is the best motion flow. It's very fluid. When you combine the game mode with the motion flow, this is what you get. And when I do my official review, you will see why I say that Samsung Q8FN, 
Q9FN is the best balanced TV. Okay, it's the, I don't want to use the word best, but it's the most balanced TV. Okay, I think it's, that's a fair war, uh, word to use, balanced TV. Some people say, oh, I didn't say best. This is not the best TV. This is not the, the perfect TV. It doesn't exist. There's no perfect TV. There's no best TV, okay? This is the most balanced, the most balanced TV you're going to get for the money at the moment as of this recording, okay? Why is the most balanced TV? Well, you're going to have to wait for the 43-minute review, extensive 43-minute review before Thanksgiving. I will do a 43-minute review. I will talk about it. I will sit right in front of the TV. I will explain everything step-by-step step for you. I'll even put the chapters on the description for you guys to select a different chapter and what you're interested in 43 minutes. What do you want to learn? Do you want to learn about uh, what the components are in this TV, how it works? Do you want to learn about uh, the game mode, the motion flow? How does that work? I will have all of that in the description when I do the video. And some people say, the way I talk, it's kind of off-putting. Well, dude, this is how I talk. You know, what I'm supposed to do. I, I'm not, I don't want to act. Uh, that's sponsored influential YouTubers. Oh, hi, hi, how you guys doing? No, I don't do that. I don't do that. That's not me. If you want that, there's plenty of la, 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 influential uh, Hollywood, lo, lo, la, 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 Los Angeles uh, divas out there who's going to do that for you. Read the script, heavily edit it. You, can, you don't watch them, you can go watch them if that's what gets your rocks off, okay? I'm not that. I don't do that, guys. I'm, this is me. This is what you get. And if you don't like it, go. Go. Move. God bless you. Be on your way. That simple. Let's get back to this game, you know. And I'm look guys, I'm not trying to be a dick here. I'm just telling you how it is. While I'm running this channel, this is how it is. Expert Joey will tell you that. Dirty Sprite will tell you that. Uh, Ralph Perez will tell you that. Demetrios, who I love, you guys need to check Demetrios, will tell you that. I love Demetrios, he's my brother. He will tell you that. Demetrios says the best. If you don't like it, get the fuck off the YouTube. If you don't like it, don't watch it. He said it the best one time. I did a video about Demetrius where he says, if you don't like it, just get the fuck off the YouTube. Don't watch it. No one's being forced to watch this. You don't have to watch it. But I don't have to listen to you. Write me a love and peace letter on the comment section. Dude, you don't like it? Don't watch it. But for those of you who do, remember, this is how you get to the game mode. You got to have this TV. Guys, listen. You got to have this TV. Okay? If you have a Samsung KS8000, it's not going to work. You got to have a QLED series. You got to have a Q6, Q7, Q8, and Q9. Just remember, Q6 and Q7, it's edge lit. Q8 and Q9, it's their higher, top-of-the-line Samsung lineup televisions at the moment as of 2018. All right? This is a 2018 television. This is brand new. Okay, this is Q8FN. It's full array of local dimming, very aggressive local dimming. How do you go to the uh, game mode? Do not go to the picture settings. You're not going to find the game mode in the picture settings. You got to go down to general, click on a general, and then go down to external device manager. And if you look on your right, it's going to tell you exactly what it is. Game mode settings, uh, any net plus HDMI settings, UHD uh, color settings, Black level settings, device connect settings. So go to the external device manager, click on the game mode settings, click on it, and from here you can select automatic, on or off, uh, free sync. This is something you use only if you know that your computer or your device is supporting. If it doesn't support it, then don't use it. Game motion plus settings. This is where you can adjust your blur reduction and your jutter reduction. Keep the judder at 5. Keep the blur at 5. I This is my recommendation. This is not a law. You don't have to go by this. Okay? Guys, you don't have to go by this. You don't have to uh, 
think about this as like, oh, this is some kind of law. I have to know. It's not. This is my personal preference. I'm giving you some advice. Uh, try it. Okay, at least give it a try. Okay, you don't have to like it. You don't have to love this. You can crank this up to the 10 or whatever you want to do. But you should at least give it a try. That's what recipes are. They're custom recipes. It's for you to give it a try. So give this a try. Let me know what you think. If you don't like it, dude, just go back to whatever you had. I mean, I, I don't know why is this so hard for people to understand. Your, your settings are wrong, dude. Dude. Soon, soon as your word starts by saying dude, as soon as you start calling me a dude, I am done with you. Okay? I'm not your dude. Okay? I'm a grown-ass man, so maybe you should give me some respect, all right? Instead of calling me a dude. I'm not your dude, man. And I'm not your friend either. I don't know you, dude. Okay, you could be a bot. You could be a Russian bot, Asian bot. I don't know. Saudi Arabian bot. I don't know. Which, whichever the fuck bots out there. All right? So don't waste my time. All right? Here we go. So, remember, blur reduction, judder reduction has to be at five. In my honest opinion, I believe five is going to give you the best possible motion flow. Cranking it up all the way to 10, you will see some ghosting. You will see some ghosting and some artifacts. You know, it's not going to look as smooth. The idea is for the motion flow and the low input lag to be smooth. And if you want that smoothness, keep it at balance. Why is this so hard to understand? You know. But if you don't like it, if you don't like these settings, remember what I said. If you don't like these settings, go back to whatever you were using. But please, don't write me a love and peace letter trying to tell me, oh, my settings are wrong. No, they're not wrong. They're just my own preference settings, my recipe, my advice. If you don't want to use it, don't use it. It doesn't cost you anything. But at least you should give it a try and let me know what you think. All right, guys. Well, there you have it. Thank you for watching. Uh, make sure you check my previous video, the analysis of Red Dead Redemption 2. Red Dead Redemption 2 is just around the corner, man. Uh, we got a couple of days left. And uh, as you all know, it's just less than 48 hours. It's almost here. And uh, can't wait to do it. I think I'm going to take a couple of days off Wednesday and Thursday. I don't think I'll do any videos. I'll be on, uh, you know, community forums. I'll put some stuff on there. But... Uh, uh, remember, I'm getting ready for the game. We'll do some comparison. The first video is going to be a the Xbox One X version because that's the version everybody wants to see. That's that's what everybody cares about. They care about the Xbox One X version. So that's the first thing I'm going to do. And then later on, we're going to do PlayStation 4 Pro comparisons, picture settings, some gameplay. Then we're going to try out the TCL to see how well Xbox One X and PlayStation 4 Pro runs on the game mode on the TCL. And then compare it with Sony 930, I mean 900E, I'm sorry. And uh, yeah, see how it is. Okay, as far as Samsung KS8000, guys, Samsung KS8000 is showing its age. Uh, it, it, it's still a good TV, but it's an old TV now. It's three and a half years. It's old, okay? And technology is getting old. It was great at the time when it was released, but now it's showing its age, especially with that edge lid, man. That edge lid, come on. Uh, that edge lid, it's... If you never experienced full, full array... If you, it, here's, a, here's what I want to say. If you, never, if you never experienced Q8FN or Q9FN, and all you have is KS8000, then you don't know. But once you go back uh, to the edge lid, it's really, it's really hard to go back fr from this to the edge lid. It's almost impossible. Like your eyes are telling you something's wrong here. Okay? It doesn't mean that I hate the TV. I'm just letting you know the TV's getting old. It's still a good TV, but it's getting old. Okay? That's just the way it is. All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching. And uh, But if you guys want me to to do some tests and gameplay with Grant, uh, with uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 on the KSA 1000. I'll be more than happy to do it if you guys want me to do it. You guys can let me know on my forums. Go to my YouTube forums. Go to my Facebook. Let me know. 
Uh, you guys can send in requests. Let me know. I mean, I don't know why you guys are not doing this. Send me a request. Let me know. You know, that's where it's the best way for you to do it. Do it on my community page. Do it on the Facebook. Do it on the uh, my Discord. And, of course, my Xbox Live, my PlayStation Network, you can contact me there and give me some, uh, uh, you know, suggestions on what would you like to see and stuff like that. All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching. Sorry about the 20-minute video, but I had to, uh, you know, cover some stuff and let you know about some things uh, the way my YouTube channel is. I don't even know why I have to constantly repeat this and express this, but some new people who come to my channel, they don't seem to understand Hopefully, you guys who are my moderators, like Expert Joey and Dirty Sprite, hopefully you guys will uh, let these new subscribers know how my channel is. Like, give them some key pointers. Let them know, look, this is how this guy runs his channel, so you understand. Uh, so that way, they understand uh, how I run it, you know. Anyway, like I said, big shout out to Expert Joey, Dirty Sprite, Ralph Perez, uh, and everybody else. Thank you, guys. Have a good one, though. Take care.